I'm trying to find the best lighting, but I don't think I can find it too much. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Dominique Mustin. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my glam room tour. <laughs> of this room it used to be my sister's but she's lived in Georgia and she comes back here but she just comes back to visit it's not like she comes to live so December 2018 over my Christmas break I redid my room and I redid this room I basically turned my room into like a more comfortable urban -y style room I actually have a room tour on it um, somewhere down in my channel it doesn't look like that well it does look like that, but I redid it again, so it looks a little bit different. But this room, I basically redid her room. Her old room looked like this. I turned it into this, and I call it my glam room. I'm super into makeup, and I like do people's hair all the time, and I'm into just beauty stuff. And I've always wanted my own beauty room. I'm super happy, I love it. Every time my friends come over, we just hang out in here. It's perfect for filming. I made it literally the week before I started my YouTube channel. So honestly, it just worked out so perfectly and I'm gonna be so sad when I have to leave it in college, but I know in my future home, I will definitely have my own glam room. Without further ado, I'm gonna show you my room. I'm sure you probably saw it by now, but for anyone who was curious, I'm gonna show you it all in detail. Let's get into it. I'm gonna start in this little section over here. So this right here is my clothing rack. Down here, I just have all of my nicer shoes. I kind of wanted to keep it more girly. These are just simple tops from like, this is from Fashion Nova, Crybaby, um, Laura's Boutique is this sweater, and then other things. I think this is from like Tiger Miss. It's a cute little golfer set. I got this white clothing rack from Amazon, I believe. And then over here, I have two little mirrors. These actually came in a pack of three. I had them in my old, old room. There's a gray one too, but I think it's hidden behind my mirror over there. These are just from Target. I don't know if they're still at Target. I got them such a long time ago. Just decided to hang them up right there because it looked kind of boring. Over here is like my favorite section. Up here is a shelf that I actually just got hung up by my uncle very recently. And it holds all my awards and I think they're just cute to have in here. Eight rings, my Gatorade, uh, Chandler Rotary, Arizona Central, and then my own like teams, athlete of the year. And then right below it is my beautiful vanity and Alex drawers. So I have the nine, I don't know what they're called. I have the nine drawer Alex drawers. These are from Ikea. This is from, I know that they still have these, like there's no way they're getting rid of these, but I did get them a long time ago. On top of them though, I have this cute little mirror that if you follow my Dommies Beauty account, you probably see that I use it all the time. It's super dirty because I was doing my eyelashes by myself one day, which I'll never, ever, ever do again. And I got glue all over it. This is from Urban Outfitters. And then I have this cute winter candle. And then back here, I just have a little D mug and some perfume bottles that are black and white. They just go perfectly with the theme of this room. So I change this up all the time. Like these back here used to be over there, but I kind of like the way that it looks right now. So I think I'm gonna keep it for a while. This is also from Ikea. Uh, it's a, called a floating shelf. So there's five small ones and then there's four big ones. So right here is my vanity desk. This right here, this complete setup used to be in my other room. So this vanity mirror that you see, I got it for Christmas in 2018. It is from Impressions Vanities. And right here, you can see the brand. Because this little mirror that has no batteries in it, it's the white one. They have so many different kinds. They have black, they have like clear where it could just look like a mirror, like just this part and have the bulbs in it. It's super cool actually. Um, and then this desk I've had forever. It's the Mickey desk from Ikea. I used to have an outlet right there. That's why it's like the paint chipped, but it's smart. If you want to command stick an outlet on the side, I suggest you do it. I just like don't really do my hair in my room, but I think if you do, then that's cool. 
And this chair right here is from Amazon. I love this chair. My friend Mallory actually had it first and then I couldn't find a chair that I liked so I just got the same exact one as her. But it's okay because she loves me. These little cups right here, you can I think you can find them anywhere. They're very popular. But I did get mine from IKEA just in the little shop through section. We just threw them in the cart and then all these brushes I've collected throughout years. Clearly trash day. I don't think you can hear it. No. They're like right outside my house. Down here is just a little trash can. It wasn't even mine. This chair I got for Christmas last year. This chair right here is basically like a director's chair or like, you know, like a makeup chair. I don't think I've ever done anyone's makeup in it, but I think it goes perfectly right here. And I still want to get a sign above there. I just haven't done it yet. But I believe this chair is from Amazon. Honestly, I think you could look it up anywhere and find it. There's this beautiful mirror right here where I take majority of my photos is from Target. I just slanted it in the corner and I think it worked out honestly perfectly. I love it. And then right here, the this is from Target. It's just a little hook and I hang my necklaces on it. I have one Alex and Annie bracelet hanging on it, but that's because that's literally my only bracelet. I threw out the rest. And then right here, this thing, my ring light, I'm actually gonna turn it off. My ring light right here is also from Impressions Vanities. It's the same place that my mirror and my little mirror right there are from. This is a $300 ring light, but I got it on a Labor Day sale for 150. So 50% off, I mean, that's pretty good. That's the reason that I got it. I love it because it has two different settings. So if you turn it this way, it gets cold. And if you turn it like, oh wait, oh, hold on, I'm messing up. If you turn it this way, you can make it warm. Or if you turn it this way, you can make it like cool. This thing moves all around my room, but usually I have it set up right here um, cause it's kind of just like an open space. And then me and my friends will film on this blank wall right here, which I've honestly wanted to decorate for so long. It just takes so much effort because you have to do it like perfectly. And for a person like me, I would like probably move things around like 900 times. It's just stressful to think about. Move on to this little section. I love it. I've also redecorated it a million times. Up here, I have this, which I don't even like. I've had it for so long, but it's just from Target. This is my Ariana Grande perfume. I love perfumes like this because they look so much more expensive than they probably are. And then this is my candle from Bath & Body Works. It's just white. I try to get candles that match my room because not that I really burn them that much. I just like them for decoration. I love candles, so I'm gonna get a million of them. But if I'm gonna get them, I'm gonna make sure that they match my room decor. Then down here is a little mirror that I got from Bath & Body Works a very long time ago I got this. Right here, I'm definitely gonna change this up, but I kind of just have my Gucci belt um, still in the box. And then this right here is my Gucci like toiletry bag or like makeup bag. Um, it's obviously like a designer bag and I don't have a lot of designer stuff. So I sat it on the shelf to be shown off because it deserves to be shown off. And then down here are a bunch of makeup bags. Um, if you couldn't tell, like all of these are from Victoria's Secret. This is like one Morphe case, but that actually came with the brushes that I got. And then this right here, my sister and my brother-in-law got me for my birthday. Traveling makeup case, so as soon as I can leave the house and go do people's makeup. I know a couple of friends who wanted me to do their makeup for prom and this would have been perfect, but you know, maybe it'll be easier to take all my makeup to Texas in this, so who cares, but. This is also from Impressions Vanity. This is my tripod. I, I lost a screw or else I would be using this to record right now and it'd probably be a little bit better of a video, but I don't have the screw right now and it, it just like pops off and yeah. Don't tell my mom. And then up here, I just have decorations pretty much. So I wanted this room to look, you know, a little more bougie. So I know it's probably kind of like dumb to hang up my designer boxes, but I think it's cute decor for now. Right here I have my beautiful canvas of Audrey Hepburn. She's like the queen of beauty. And this is the perfect photo. And over here is nothing. So that's pretty much the end. The only thing that I don't really like about this room is that it has the worst lighting. Like I have, not not the worst lighting. Like I have all this lighting, but for natural lighting, like I'm like in the backyard. I don't always get the best. So yes, it's gonna look like I have a bunch of ring lights and vanity lights on my face, but that's okay. It is what it is. But I kind of wanted to give like an up close of like where everything's from. I again, 
You've probably seen this room already. I film in this room all the time. So hopefully you enjoyed the way that I filmed this video. Hope you guys enjoyed my 2020 glam room tour. Um, I will definitely be adding to this room in the next couple of months while I'm still here and filming in this room all the time. If you have any questions about where I get stuff or where I shop, if I end up changing up my clothing rack, or anything don't have any rooms left to do any more room tours but maybe i can give you an updated one if it ever was to change i know i already changed up my other room so i mean if you want to see what it looks like it literally looks the same but if you want to know details of where all that is definitely be willing to do another one again because that video did decent i do have a beauty instagram called dommy's beauty on there i either post makeup looks or i do other people's makeup or i mainly do other people's hair I'm more confident in doing hair than I am doing makeup. Makeup is iffy, like I know what I'm doing, but at the same time, I'm no professional MUA. But I'm super into interior design for as much as I'm educated on it and that I know about it. Make sure to follow that account. Yeah, if you ever wanna be on that account, like some of my other family members and friends, just DM me or text me. Come over and I will do your hair in the beautiful chairs right over here or whatever you want done and i'll post you on my account and it'll be so much fun and that's how you make new friends thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video